Singapore businesses cannot expect to save costs by employing more low-cost workers," said Prime Minister Lee Hsien Loong, addressing participants at the CEO and Employer Summit. PM Lee said firms should adopt alternative measures to cut costs for sustainable growth. Since the global recession in 2008, unemployment rates peaked at 3.3 percent in the third quarter of last year. Instead of cutting jobs to save costs, the government encouraged local businesses to do the opposite by cutting costs to save jobs. This method seems to work as unemployment rates have dropped to 2.2 percent in the first quarter of this year. Being productive means deriving maximum value or creating maximum value out of limited resources. If you want to raise productivity, either you can use fewer resources to produce the same value, or deploy the same amount of resources to more productive purposes and do better out of them, and generate more value out of them. Singapore businesses cannot expect to save costs by employing more low-cost workers. Instead, you have got to utilize resources efficiently, develop new markets, and innovate. Now we should re- direct our energies and our tripartite efforts on a new challenge, namely improving our productivity. Singapore National Employers Federation organized the CEO and Employers Summit to celebrate its 30th anniversary. Over 900 participants gathered to discuss issues on the challenges in leadership and management. Held over two days from the 28th to 29th of July, dialogues and talks will be conducted to address the issue of productivity and sustainable growth. In his keynote address. Prime Minister Lee Hsien Loong highlighted the need for CEOs to lead the way for improvements in productivity. A huge part of the responsibility for raising productivity falls on employers and business leaders. In other words, our audience today. New markets could be overseas. New markets could be domestic, in unfilled or undiscovered niches, but they present new business opportunities. The challenge is for the CEOs to go and identify them and act on them before others do. And flexible labour practices are key to improving productivity, according to PM Lee. Companies have to be nimble and adaptable to respond to these changing market conditions. You need enormous flexibility to anticipate changes, to adapt, and to do well. In other words, to underpin. Your improvements in productivity, you need enormous flexibility. Flexibility in skills, flexibility in wages, flexibility in mindsets. So, to be flexible, you need to be flexible in your jobs, in your wages, but especially in your mindsets. It's the most basic and critical flexibility. For more insights. Catch PM Lee's full address on Razor TV's News Squared.